Hey everyone, in this video, I will explain you how to use the new version of the React Router DOM. So, if you are using the older version of the React Routers, so this is not gonna work in this new version. So, you will need to install the new version of the React Router DOM. So, here you can see my React Router DOM version is 6.9.0. If you want to update your router DOM or you didn't install it yet so for the installation you need to open the terminal and type npm install react router DOM so let's take a look how to use it first of all I will import create browser router from the react router DOM in this new version we will use this like this previously we will use it browser router only in this new version we will use it create browser router so here I am creating a new constant router equal to create browser router and open and closing parenthesis in these parenthesis I will create one more router like create routes from element this is a new element from the router DOM library and then open and closing parenthesis here I will import route from the router DOM library this will our parent route and this route we will use other routes here I will give this path of slash because this will per our neighbor this neighbor will shown in the all routes now I am using element here to use my neighbor component I will add it here so this is imported automatically in this neighbor route I will use more routes like about contact and home here I will import home now I will use this home component in the new route here I am using route and I will give this path so I am giving this a slash path because this will be rendered automatically when someone open our app in the browser so I am adding here an element and the element I will use home component now I am copying this to use it for the more components so you need to create first the elements if you are used to write it here this will not gonna work I already created it and then I am using it here so first create components and use it like this here so I am giving this path and I will change also the elements here so I imported all the components and change the paths and the components in the element so here I will import one more thing which is router provider and it is important here I will add one more thing which is router router and then in this I will use this router which is I used for the create browser router now this is almost done for the app component but we will use the navbar component now because we will add some links for the about contact in the more page so neighbor is the parent component for the other four routes so here in the neighbor component first we need to import link here here in the link we use the two attribute 
basically the two attribute is used for the path so here we will give the path which we used for the route in the previous f component so here i will change the name of it and change the path this is important so add the same path which we added in the routes here i will change the path after that i will cut that here and add in the new div because we will use a new thing here which is outlet outlet is basically we use for the data where our neighbor data will show so here you can see i will click on about here it's working contact and more it's all working so this is the new way up to use the react routers so thank you guys for watching